Good. So me uh, 58 Goldie, which you've seen seen me ride on the road and that was giving me a pain in the knee, given that my knee is trying to dislocate itself and I need a new one. Um, so two years ago, I got onto that uh, fellow Pearson in the UK and I said, I got him to send it to a box that I was getting in the States and it got in the box and come here. That was two years ago. About a year ago, I started looking at it and then decided I had to do something in the last few months because I wasn't riding it. So anyway, this kit from Pearson involves a starter motor which is down under the under the uh, engine plates, well, below the gearbox basically. It's a little bit low but in actual fact the, the centre stand on this bike hangs a bit low so I'll just have to be careful over speed bumps I guess. But there's a chain drive that comes up into the centre of the inner primary and then there's a crossover Bendix drive, which is kind of like a big Acme screw, you know, like in your lathe. It's when the when the starter motor spins the sprocket behind the primary, it throws that out. That engages um, a ratchet, like a fair two ratchets, which is very similar to what is the uh, what is on your Triumph and BSA Kickstarters. So it engages, it spins the engine, so long as you've got the decompressor in, and then let the decompressor go when she's up to speed, and it'll fire, providing you've got your magneto in about the right spot you know kind of halfway like I just did then um, and then yeah it's it's doing the job you know half a dozen starts so far haven't ridden it yet but hey what's that got to do with the riding it's just starting and um, very happy it's going to save me knee a lot of pain it's uh, 58 gold star uh, put it together out of bits and pieces you've seen the bike before but just thought I'd mention it again it's run run to a small uh, db i think they call the it's a 32 mil carburetor it's actually a 500 head but it's just possibly the trials models or i'm not sure what had the 32 carb so there's a 32 mark one on there and it's it's got touring cams in it i've got another full wank dbd with a pearson press-up crank 38 mil cams and all that sort of shit that's with a five speed and a Norton feather bed that's coming along. I mean, on that one, I'm trying to fit a well, I am a, with a Triumph clutch on the gearbox, putting a, a ring gear on it for a Harley Sportster and a Harley Sportster starter, so it won't need the decompression. It'll, well, it'll probably help it, but it should just whiz over pretty good with a starter motor designed to fling across a, a 1200. Um, but anyway, so. This is my nice little Goldie, it's a nice little thing to ride, it's like I say, it's fairly low key, it's not sort of highly tuned DBD race engine or nothing, and um, I uh, enjoy riding it, now I'll enjoy riding it even more that I can start the thing without, you know, without it giving me a bit of grief, so that's what happens when you get old. Um, the kit I think was about 1200 pound. Um, reasonably substantial, I suppose. Um, you know, all the starter stuff itself and a, a regulator. You had to get the, the generator done to 12 volt and change the system over to negative because it's just a, you know, to, in order to make that starter motor work, it's got to go 12 volt negative. So it's a bit of mucking about, but honestly, um, you saw how well that starts. The first start was a cold one. Um, so Look, I'm happy with pig, pig and shit, to be honest. And um, it gives me back a, a motorcycle, along with now Jude has her little AJS massless thing that you can see that on this channel. Um, it has a, a generator starter motor with a V-belt drive, very much like what you find on the uh, Motor Guzzi singles, the Falcons and all Falcons or whatever you want to call them. Um, 
that's where I got the idea from. And I looked around for a starter jenny, and there you go. It, it, you know, but it's a, it's a generator, and uh, starter motor to start with at about a thousand RPM, it drops into a generator mode. But anyway, that's another bike, and that gives us two singles now: one for her, one for me, that we can just fire off the button. So life is good. Thanks for watching.